Hello YouTube, I'm back again. It's been a while since I've done a hair video, um, but recently I found some kinky straight hair again that I'm going to attempt to install on camera and give a review on how well and how good the texture of the hair is. So I've pre-washed it. I've pre-washed the hair I'm going to be using three bundles. These are actual bundles this time. The last hair that I had wasn't actually in a bundle, but this is pre-washed. I'm gonna use three of these. And I'm also gonna use a closure this time. This time I'm using a closure. I wish that I could have, um, I don't even know how to um, bleach. This part here so that my the scalp part will be good but this is a nice closure this is a pretty nice closure I actually like it and it's a um, kinky straight closure also so the lengths of the hair that I'm using is 20 inches all of my bundles are the exact same length I didn't want them to be different lengths for the texture of this hair and my closure is a 16 inch okay what I'm gonna attempt to do is I'm going to sew this hair in. I think I'm just to try to start it while I'm on camera with you all. Don't laugh at me. I'm about to take this scarf off my head. All right. So it's a tip. It's a specific way that I sew my hair in because right now it's already braided down. All right. As you can see, I have my part way over here again this time. That is also how I'm going to have it. Um, I'm going to lay my closure part right here also. I wanted to make sure that my part was way to the side because that's where I'm going to lay my closure. I'm going to start off sewing in the first bundle at the back. And the way that I sew my hair in, the way that I sew it in is... I lay it like this and when it comes to the front because I wanted to be able to cover my face I wanted to be more on my face instead of me sewing it straight to the back like that I make sure that I sew it going upwards if you can see I sew it like this when I get to the front so that it lays in my face more okay even at the back. When I'm at the back, I'm sewing in a U. Everything is in a U shape. Everything is in a U shape the way that I sew the hair in. All right. I'm going to attempt to start sewing it in now. Then I'm going to come back and I will show you the finished product. So here we go. So I'm going to finish this. This is my first bundle. Look, I still got all this left. I thought I was going to be able to finish it, but I'll come back when everything is done. Okay, so here goes the finished product um, with the closure. 
have to pluck away a little bit of the the hair right here so it can look like I have a nice clean part. Um, but yes, look at it. I wanted y'all to see it before I flat iron it. If I decide to flat iron it, I may just curl it um, in this state like this. But this is the hair, y'all. How do you like it? My daughter said for me to uh, wear it like this and not curl it. She said, Mom, it's pretty just like that. I agree. It's beautiful. Once again, I will leave you the link to purchase this hair and the company that I got it from. So that you may get it if you want to um, achieve the same desire to look. Oh, this hair has revived me, honey. Yes, it's Pretty. I love it. I love it. I love it. Comment or subscribe to tell me what you think about it. Um, at the end of the video, I'll show you a couple of pictures of what it looks like after I style it. Thank you for watching me again, y'all. And I will be making more videos. Let me know. Okay, I'm going to make some more videos of other styles because this, this hair would be really, really pretty with like a twist out or another Bantu not out. I'm gonna have to keep up with my videos, okay? My daughter told me I needed to, so this is the one time where the parents gonna listen to their kids, huh? All right, y'all.